automotives to heavy equipment, culinary arts to hairdressing. This year's Provincial Skills Competition drew 650 post-secondary and high school students. Everybody's looking for skilled tradespersons. They want to have people who want to go into the trades. They're looking for apprentices. We would like the youth that are coming out of high school to come into the trades. In Alberta, the trades are calling. Skills Canada Alberta presented students in skills competitions such as pastry chef Courtney Thomas did as a student. It got me faster at doing what I do. People see that you can perform under pressure and they just love that because you don't get stressed out as easily. Peter Keith judged culinary students. They were each given chickens this morning and they're deboning the chickens and properly processing it as if they're in a restaurant, you know, getting it ready for for the recipe that they're using. It was all about building confidence and turning kids onto the trades. We let them go hands-on with the equipment, so tire changing, tire balancing, wheel alignment, just to see if it would spark an interest with the kids. You know, going forward, is, is this something they would like to do? In a lot of the compulsory and non-compulsory trades, people could be earning from anywhere from 40 to $48 an hour. So with their number of regular hours and overtime hours in a general year, someone could make over $100,000 in salary alone. And that range includes iron workers, electricians, carpenters, pipe fitters and scaffolders. Some trades are less lucrative in general. Here in Alberta, we're seeing a lot more need. I think looking into the future, it's going to be growing and growing and, and uh, lots and lots of openings for young chefs. If you want to look at an actual trend in our business right now, it's the special, special diets. You know, gluten-free is the future of cooking. If you can be a chef that makes excellent gluten-free food, you'll be very successful in North America. The Skills Canada competition. Some students are influenced into trades. Some are recruited into industry because of it simply looks great on a resume. This, of course, is the province of opportunity. I'm Tim Dancy.